Okay, let's continue with this uh, software training about the best practice for introduction. Okay, in this chapter, we're gonna talk about this enable document editing. I don't like this too much, but it's something that you, you have to know. Uh, we're gonna do some drill down information and uh, enable uh, reporting sorting in preview so the user can sort by this column by this column okay and let's go let's go okay the first thing that I want to show you here is the data editing I, I say I don't like it but it's something that this have if you if you go to this this price and look in the property for editing uh, you see here you have enable so if you enable people can write in the in the report we're gonna enable and you can put an editor if the data is integer you can put integer but in this case uh, this is a fixed point can be fixed point positive only because if you don't want the people to put negative value but I just want to show you quickly what this works. I just have in the list, so I, I don't. If you see now, I can go here and change the value, but the total is not refreshing. You have to make some something behind to do this, and but maybe in some case, if you have a a form and you want the people can write in the form information and then print is great because they you can feel it you can put write your name write your age and um, and then blah 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 and everything and you can just at final say print and they are gonna print the information they have here okay so it's not it's not uh, that all a problem uh, depends on what you're doing with this okay but for now we don't we don't need this uh, I don't we don't need these uh, things so we can just leave it like this okay the next uh, things that I want to show you is drill down drill down so we can just hide and show content because we click in some place and then okay for this we are gonna select this remember this subcategory and then we are gonna add here a suit band suit band remember is a band behind the uh, the main band the main band um, is uh, in the same in the same way okay this band uh, we we're gonna add some test here let me look at here a uh, label okay and if you see this takes all the setting from the but the previous band so we can just come here and reset this setting uh, reset this to transparent um we have here border we can just take away the border no and then we have this guy okay we're gonna we're gonna make this a more a, how i say oh let me do by here because i want to to do here a, let me put a blue like link you see like link in a, a let me see if i have another blue here this one I like this one a little more okay but yes this one is more I don't know I'm, I'm a little tricky with it okay but don't don't, don't 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 worry about this you can put the color and anything okay so what we're gonna do here we're gonna put to this label a name I'm gonna put here show and hide. Okay. Um, in the test, I'm gonna put show and hide. 
show or hide details. So it's not show, show and hide, it's show or, or hide details. So we have here this one, and we're gonna put this. If you see, now it's like a hyperlink that we can just click, click. Okay. Then I have this information here. Okay, I have show. Let me change this for show or hide. Because in some moment you're gonna have this solution, and I, I don't want to, you to that. Okay. Then I go to this space. If you see, is if I select from here, is everything select. So here I'm gonna look up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look up here for drill down. Drill. You see, drill down control. I just have to select from here. If you see, I have this label. That's why I put a name from the new label because if I, I don't put a name, I don't know where is a key label one, a key label two. You know, show and hide. This is that one. This drill down span is because if you want this can be just no span for the first time. You use a put in false and you have to select the show and hide if you want to show this information. Okay, so let's try this. Okay, if we zoom in and we go to the first category, this one. I can show, uh, if you see, hide, hide, hide this, hide this, and I have, you see, all the information here, and I can show and hide, show and hide, and people can interact with the report, so you can, you can make a report with uh, a list of employee, and you say, click here for see the picture, and people can click and show, show you the picture for them, and the picture don't uh, reserve uh, a lot of space in the report, so the people just see when they just click here. Um, no, okay. And now we have a, a lot of interaction. We have our document map, a table of contents, drill down. So the next things that I want to show to you is. Uh, because now we sort by color. You remember we sort, sort by, co by color, but if the user want to make their own sort, what happened with them? They, they, don't, they don't have space to sort because the sorting is uh, is made by, by, by us, by, by, by color. So we need to let, let them make the sort by, by themselves. Okay, so what I need to do that, okay, we have, if you see, we have here this color in this sorting. I'm going to add a new sorting by name to, okay, color, color and name. Okay, now I'm going to do another thing. I'm going to take this. And I'm going to say here, sort, sorting, setting, interactive sorting. Okay, so when I click this guy, this uh, product name, I want to sort the, uh, sorry, target band first, because you need to, not, this is the target band, the detail, the detail one, you see. The detail, not the detail, the detail is this, the detail one. Okay. And this detail one, I have the name. Okay. And then in the color, I can do the same sorting, interactive sorting. I select the band first. You see, detail one. And then the name is color. So I have connect this title to name and this color to color okay perfect then we can test this submit and then we can go to any category maybe mountain bike okay this is a good one we can just sort here if you see we can sort the name and we can sort the color too 
and we can add the price too. We, we can just put the price and we can solve by price the bigger for the and the less. And if you see, this is uh, we have drill down, we have sorting, we have editing, and we have everything in this chart done. Okay, and then we make a little pause and continue with the next chart in a moment. Thank you.